Call me crazy or call me call me a, a lot of different things but i'm either crazy or i'm very trusting because today we're in for a special surprise my 17 year old oldest boy he gets to drive the roadster for the first time today we have the top off he's got gas in the car he gets to drive the roadster for the very first time he's gonna be graduating this year and we want him on the road driving hot rod maybe some of the trucks and doing some trips with us let's say a little prayer that it all works out <laughs> So here it is, it's time. We did a quick little drive around the neighborhood and now Luke is in the driver's seat. We're gonna go slow at first and then we're gonna get it really out on the road. So there's Luke. So Luke is behind the, the driver's seat now and Luke, this is your first drive in the Roadster, right? Yeah. First really drive in any hot rod. Yeah. I mean, you've been in them all your life, but yeah. your first time behind the wheel, right? 17 years old and your dad is letting you drive his beloved roadster yeah so are you nervous yes yes okay how nervous pretty nervous so don't be too nervous that makes me more nervous All right. so over to the left down that's reverse one more neutral drive okay so one of the things driving any of these cars, obviously I was telling Luke, we don't have power steering, power brakes, all that stuff. Uh, we do have front disc brakes, so this thing stops. Um, but just getting used to the gear shift. Uh, it's got a, uh, a 383 stroker with 700 R4, but a shift. So when it shifts, it, it'll throw you back. And just getting used to everything. And Luke is a little taller as well, so his knees and clearance uh, with the steering wheel, so go left we'll just kind of drive around the block so that way you get the hang of yep yep just turn yep Back through. yep and here he is he's driving a roadster comment below would you let your 17 year old drive your uh your roadster this is, this is something that I've been wanting him to do for quite a while. We've been talking about it. So let's go around the block one more time, Luke, and then we'll get you out on the road. Yep. So how's it feel? Fairly easy, yeah. right? Nothing too crazy. I think he's a pro. He's got it all figured out. Going around the block. We're, are we ready for the road? Um, if you think we are, I don't know. I think we are. Now we haven't hit any bumps yet. We are running bias plies. We got 16s and 18s on here. So right now we're doing 20 mile an hour in the neighborhood. So we're, we're going to do some back roads before we do a longer drive here for dinner. And we have a little time for a drive. So let's go left. So how do you coach your 17-year-old when he, he thinks he needs Well, you told me you used two feet, and I'm not used to doing that. Yeah, but you gotta lift your... Uh, I tell him to use both feet because if he uses his right foot, his knee will hit the steering wheel. So I use my left foot so it's underneath on the other side. So you gotta let off the gas when we're going, okay? So let's go back this way. We'll go out uh, by the school. So you can kind of see what I'm talking about. His knees hit, because he's taller. So his knees hit the steering wheel, how it's positioned. So it's easier in this car, just letting off uh, the gas and, and using your other foot. I'm used to it, but you'll see a different face if we're going fast and we have to do that.
straddle it rather than run over it. So straddle it. Right, right, right. Yep. That's another thing we're teaching as well. If we see a pothole or a big hole in a road, how to straddle it, not necessarily go around it. Um, this thing's pretty low, but it's not too buried where we're gonna rip off an oil pan. tremendous um, I had no doubt so yes, you did. huh yes, you did. no if I had serious doubts I wouldn't let my 17 year old son drive the car now would we put him on the highway the first day no we wouldn't um, but we're, we're kind of going slow some back roads and and we'll pick up speed we're gonna do a little bit longer of a drive here uh, to dinner with family but if I didn't have confidence no, because you know me. I wouldn't put him behind the wheel of a very expensive uh, roadster by any means. But you're doing great. I may have said this earlier, but uh, this is something I always wanted to do with my father and never got right. to do. But never got to do because he passed away young at 51. Um, so... I'd probably do anything if I had this opportunity to, to ride and drive in a hot rod with my father. So this is something I'll cherish forever. Now go slow over the tracks, right? So we definitely got to slow down. Yep, and stay off of the gravel. So we'll go a little slower. You can go, yep. Yep, not too bad. So you can go across, yep, go ahead. this way you're good
graduates this year, since he's a senior, I really want him to do a road trip or two with me and maybe let us know where would be a good trip, whether we take one of the hot rods or we've talked about driving one of the OBS trucks, doing a truck show, or just doing a destination. It doesn't even have to be a truck show. It may be a good guy show pretty far away, but we want stops along the way and some visits with friends and, and shop tours, but it's really about the destination and seeing new things. So comment, where should we go, Luke and I, maybe for his graduation trip, that uh, we're just on the road and filming that whole trip and, and sharing it with you. Luke, where do you think that you would want to go on a road trip? trip and the scenery then. Yeah. reached our destination and Luke what do you think it was your honestly your first drive in the Roadster what's your thoughts uh, well I was pretty nervous to begin with but I had a lot of fun and I really yeah. enjoyed it yeah. and you got to get on it a little bit toward the end mm -hmm. yeah so we're gonna do more rides the next one should we drive the blue truck next sure we're gonna drive that one next so anything else for everybody watching um no not really Yep. Oh, hit the subscribe button and like the video. So 83% of you that are watching these videos, you haven't hit the subscribe button yet. So be sure to do that. Give us a thumbs up if you like today's video. It really helps the YouTube algorithm, helps our channel grow and to push these videos out even more. But until next time, we appreciate you watching. Thanks to Luke. That was a fun drive. Yes. Awesome. <laughs>